Good afternoon. It's already past seven. I was gonna do a little bit earlier, but I was looking at someone's scope at Amazon Go. The store is very interesting. It's cashless, cash, cashless, and I saw the you know their plan, Amazon Go plan uh, last year. This looks like exactly the same as their plan. Hi, thanks for coming. Periscope is very interesting. It's a lot of TV show is going on and I saw someone is teaching Photoshop. It's like more quality, I think. Oh, okay. I'm going to log in from my Japanese account as well. And if you are learning Japanese, then please follow my account, Snow Sugar. I'm doing Japanese scope and 12 hours apart and I did this morning 6.30 a.m. and Eastern Standard Time but Japan time was 8.30 p.m. so this is the fourth of week and now it's so many interesting scope there so I'm you know that's okay <laughs> I'm going to record this scope anyway because there's uh, so many people watching the play thank you so much for joining if you join and so if you wanted to say hi and please say hi in the comment the photo you're looking at is Koi-san and I used to do Ikigai scope um, from October to December last year and this year I was doing sort of like a hataraki guy. Hataraki guy means reason for being at work, reason for working. It's sort of value creation. We, you can apply for both your life and work. Hi, thanks for coming. So I'm sharing life hack tips and sort of like marketing also and if you're interested in I finally added the link on the title instead of profile because I noticed the profile link is not the clickable but uh, I think the title link will should be clickable when I test it so if you're interested in then please click on the link then get the free story video class then you can that's free I decided to give away so you can take this free story class and then joining this weekly scope then asking question because I'm gonna do storytelling video class when is it hold on a sec starting oh eighth week I think it's not soon <laughs> maybe next month this week is 4 of 12 and who do you want to make happy it's like a if it's a in marketing terminology we you can say target customer or person, persona or avatar so many different way to say it, but a simple way to describe it is who do you want to make happy Next week could be interesting, Mind Your Eyes Pipeline. Yeah, it's like a, we can talk about a YouTube, like a new role. And I, you know, I shared a Twitter last week. YouTube changed the new role, like a partnership, like which is like a monetizing role. So now we, we used to make some, a couple of cents when someone watching our video but now we cannot do it but they gave us a grace period until end of this month which is 31st and it's like a 10 not not even 10 days nine days more to have thousand subscribers sounds impossible I think because we have only 65 subscribers but they all suspended all the, the accounts less than thousand subscribers 
and um, four thousand not a minutes four thousand hours to be viewed every month that sounds really a lot because I don't know how many hours our channel has been viewed every month because the YouTube indicates like a second I haven't really carefully looked at it but 4,000 4, hour is really a lot but anyway that's their rule so we have you know we we cannot do anything and Amazon also changed the commission rate the, the percentage last week everybody's changing rule this month so maybe last year they didn't make enough money or they didn't reach the goal or something they decided to raise everything that's the life <laughs> so if you rely on some other platform or company and you have to think about to having your own website or having on your system something like that because if you rely on like Etsy or if you rely on Amazon if they change the role and if they kick you out you're gone <laughs> anyway so this week is we going to talk about the target customer and avatar avatar is the word uh, describing your persona uh, for the internet marketing business internet business it's no sugar video so we based on website and we based on internet um, we have a two different type of avatar so one for like this picture maybe majority of the people is a either Asian or Caucasian and female and age the age age it's hard to say the age because and you know age is changing every year so the it's going to be like a millennium like a generation and they were born between 1985 to like a 2005 or something like that so that they are our customer or avatar would be tech savvy or they know how to use smartphone, no problem to sending email or text. And making video would be no problem. Some of them a YouTuber or Instagrammer and they really it's like an influencer. Doesn't have to be top influencer, those type of the one of our avatar. Then the other avatar is like a team leader and who knows how to you know, use the technology, but not to fully understand, I think, compared to the millennials. Or maybe the team leader would be the millennium as, as well. I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe a little gap between millennials, but not that. Maybe millennials and it may not be the millennials. What's the next generation? Is generation. Generation Y or X, I forgot which one is. But anyway, we Snow Sugar has a two different avatar. So that's it's kind of like for the business side, like a marketing side to segmented your target customer or avatar. But if you wanted to think about your life, who you want to happy, who you want them to happy, who who you want who you want to make happy. So probably think about you know, surrounded by you. It's like a study, you know, about yourself, then family, then friend. That's a very normal way to think about. Then after you, you know, happy, Surround the people surround you. The next stage, you wanted to think about which organization or which nonprofit organization or which what kind of people you wanted to support. So normally, people started to think about the similar your background or similar your interest. Or it's like if you're artist, then you 
probably you wanted to support artists. It's something related, so you know why don't you think about this week after you happy, after you made your family happy, after you made your friends happy, what's next? Wh who do you want like who do you want them happy? Who do you want? I'm, I don't know. I'm, I'm really tired, I think. And if you started in business, of course, you have to write a business plan and you have to think about who is the target customer because most of them started from internet, like having website, they think that they can target entire world. So my customer is everyone who lives in this world. You can do that if you have a tons of money, but uh, if you have a shoestring budget, you have to decide pinpoint target area and target customer because otherwise you're going to waste your time and money and energy. So if you live in Japan, this is a Japanese map. Even Japan has a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven different area to think about. My hometown is the like sky blue color area, Tohoku region. Those area is looks big, but the population wise is not that many compared to the green spot. The green spot is the Kanto region, is con you know including Tokyo. So if you target him like a fisherman and maybe okay for the Tohoku region and Hokkaido. But if you target it to the millennial workers or technology people, you may not target to the, my hometown area. So this is my hometown's, um, what do you call it? Not Japan, they don't call state, and they call provi province, not a province. <laughs> Anyway, this is the uh, Miyagi Prefecture. Miyagi Prefecture. Um, there's also four different kind of area, and you can think about to how you can target if you're targeting only the city or town you live around, live in. You can think about it. But if you're doing internet business, you don't have to target only local area. Even I said pinpoint, but you don't have to have a, like only small majority of the town or place because if you are running business, you have to make certain amount of the money to cover your expenses. So you need to have a, some, you know, certain number of the people. Hi, Samsung. This is the New York State. It's much bigger than to Japan. Yes, it is English. It's night time is English now. <laughs> Morning time would be Japanese. So Japan is the, uh, I think, s almost small, same size of California. Do you see the California on the left hand side? That's the uh, pretty much same as its country Japan size. So Japan is not that big. What about New Zealand, the size of New Zealand? Yeah, Japan is tiny. Only the size of the California. Because East Coast to West Coast, it takes six hours to freight. Oh, New Zealand is similar to Japan size? Okay. And Japan to Hawaii is six hours. So that means, you know, we are East Coast and West Coast is that far. Six hours freight. So sometimes people, you know, asking me, are you going to LA so often? No, I don't. <laughs> I don't go to East, East Coast so often. 
I think we could go yeah, pretty much like a east east side like a main <laughs> yeah sort of yeah that's right this is uh, this week's topic is what is your avatar so when you run in business or when you think about <clears throat> like a ikigai maybe you can think about who you want to who you want to make happy I don't know about the New Zealand but Japan is so tiny and uh, not so many um, race now it's like a mixed culture but it used to be only Japanese or Korean Jap Japan born Korean and Japan born Chinese so they all speak Japanese lots of followers on Twitter and uh, not that much uh, because I use uh, some of the uh, app that was introduced by one of the followers but I don't think I got so many followers probably because do, do you have a YouTube channel? because YouTube changed the rule last week they announced to all the channel holders then yeah okay then you know we cannot make money anymore because unless we have a thousand subscribers and also four thousand hours to be viewed oh okay we are heavy user because we uploading video every day. It's like a, other YouTubers, but we are not the famous YouTuber. But we try to, you know, um, use the YouTube channel as a main like a platform to communicate other people. So we expected to make more money, but now almost they turn us down because we have only 65 subscribers only 9 days to 9 days left to have you know um it's it's impossible to have a thousand subscribers by 31st of January yeah i i i know that now maybe i should have some website computer YouTube <laughs> I don't know how much money I need to make that site so that those information I share is through the Twitter and one of the followers say oh no <laughs> then he shared the app to grow the followers but it's hard Twitch? Twitch is a live streaming, right? That's very popular for among Japanese people or a game player. Oh, they pay money. Oh, that's interesting. It's like uh, you now. Oh, game players. Okay, maybe I should play game. <laughs> but I have to be really good, otherwise they're not gonna pay me. Okay, now is this map is New York State map. Did you notice? This is New York State. They have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven area. It's interesting. Everybody's had seven areas. Yeah. Oh, I see. That's right. Yeah, I have to find a way to gain followers. So I just, you know, updated my landing page and sign up page. And I added because I haven't get any signer um, 
I added the link on title because I noticed the profile if I added to some link on profile it's not clickable but now I added, added on title then title should be the link could be clickable right there's a little trick all different platform <laughs> I see oh that's interesting sorry my rice cooker is ready rice is ready so <laughs> Have you scoped these days? Right, right. I know. But I can't scope outside because it's so cold last two, three weeks in New York and iPhone battery is not um, hold up. I just do the library scope only five minutes last week <laughs> I tried to do something because I know everybody wanted to see something interesting because they can't travel lots of different country oh really oh I see right right yeah that's interesting yeah I used to teach the senior and who stayed at home he they couldn't get out and they are and they were really enjoy one of my computer class and teach when I share the Google map because Google map is showing lots of picture and feels like they're traveling around they really appreciate for that This one is interesting, so I'll show you my <laughs> cooking scope. Yeah, I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about, oh, that's a great idea, Japanese cooking. Oh, that's a great idea. I was going to show some how you can cook mochi <laughs> and daifuku. Do you know daifuku? I'm thinking about it. But I have set up the nicely and I have to test it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I want to show you this interesting thing. So, if you, this is the uh, state of New York, and Manhattan is so small, the pink area is New York City. The, I don't think you can see Manhattan because it's so tiny. Then, someone is overlapping to the Japanese map, the Japan map. Oh, really? Yeah, I think so. But the thing is, the Japanese scoper, they wanted to learn English. So they don't speak Japanese, right? <laughs> they try to speak English. Um, then the other people who wanted to learn Japanese, they wanted to hear Japanese. So that's why I set up the two different channel like one for only Japanese and one for only English oh your city has a Japanese community oh interesting I think my the other phone is died the other phone dies okay now I came back oh it's Japan Japan Day Festival Japan then in New York is May, it's kind of far away, it's three months, four months from now. That'll be fun. It's like a fair, yeah, yeah. But it's kind of like a big festival, you know?
Oh, I see. It's like a spring festival. It's Sakura festival or something like that. Like Japanese food and shodo, like kari, Japanese calligraphy. Annual event, I see. So there's a lot of Japanese company sponsor, like corporate sponsor. Do you see this map is, don't you think this is interesting? It's like overlapping in Japan map and uh, New York state. Oh yeah, that's right, because they need to have more tourists in Japan. New York state is covering one third of Japan already. <laughs> so it's like from Fukushima to Kobe it's almost cover entire metropolitan area so japan has uh, so many people is like population density is very you know um right sakura festival in new york sakura should be april or may Because of the Japan is so small and the people when started businesses they tend to forget. Okay. Yeah, that's right. But that would be the so many people and it's hard to scope, especially for New York um the festival. Um but uh, I can try. Because I did some of the street fair and last time, last, last summer, so many people. So crowded. Yeah, that's the thing too. And also I need to have a maybe high heel or something. It's I need to be really taller, <laughs> otherwise. <coughs> Just showing everybody's head, right? Scoping everybody's head. <clears throat> right, bring a stool and selfie stick. Something like that, right? <clears throat> So do you own your business? Yeah, it's like a professional people because they all have a longer stick and stool. Oh, you used to? Did you write the business plan or business canvas? Oh, you're a business consultant? So in the um, United States, and most of the organization not suggested to write the business plan anymore. Uh, they use the business campus. I totally agree with them because business model has been changing so quickly, especially in United States uh, because of the internet business. So if you write in the business plan and takes six months to be finished and your business is is going to be changed. So business canvas would be the great idea to start it and target customer, even target customer has been changed because we started the business two years ago. Um, I think our target customer has been changed two times and three times. Now it's Amazon Go. Did you watch the Amazon Go live? That was very interesting. Amazon Go store. Right, but Facebook is also has changed in so many way. And the people who using Twitter and Facebook 
basically they don't want to see the advertisement right <laughs> even though they use their services for free YouTube is the same thing people don't want to see yeah live on Facebook is for to a friend I don't want to live to my friends <laughs> and family that's the thing I don't do Facebook live <laughs> hopefully Facebook can change the, the way to live streaming I think they changed a little bit like for not the uh, because used to be the only subscriber and they can do public live streaming probably they changed a couple of months ago Okay, then you did really well with your the business. Yeah, Facebook is very useful for the business and contacting people, communicating a few thousand. Wow, that's a lot of followers. And you can create a group, close the group, have a community. Community wise is very interesting because you, before the Facebook, yeah, we don't see your customer who's doing <laughs> or who where they live. It's you don't see any like a like a private side of their um but now you can see everything. <laughs> you know, if someone contacting you and you search their name under LinkedIn, right? You started a parenting movement. What's the movement? Oh, protest. Yeah, I know the protest. I, 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 my question is what kind of parenting movement do you, are you interested in or are you going to do? Child development. Interesting. I see. So you're really targeted the one certain style of the parenting. That's nice. Yeah, New York has a I I I had a once researched about a kindergarten or elementary school because I was asked by some some of the Japanese educator okay there's a very popular is Montessori method in New York mm, nice there's a lot of like different type of education system Oh, you do? Okay. And also Schneider or something? Like a two more famous one in New York. Oh, you teach too. And the New York City school system has been changed. It's better way. <laughs> And 
there's a Indian community, not American Indian, like Indian community and uh, Chinese community has a very specific ex education system. Mm. Oh, I say homeschooling. Okay, homeschooling would be better. Or doesn't doesn't mean better? Or like you you just supporting the the pe the kids need to study at home by different many reasons. Right. Yeah, there's, there's a lot of different reasons. It's like uh, maybe disease, you know, can some kids can go outside because of the some skin condition or something like that. It's a lot of different reasons, I think. Yeah, sometimes it's the location. It's like only not a density area and there's no so many kids. Right, family size? Oh, I see. Oh, really? Okay. That says... There are so many things I don't even know. <laughs> um, but not the same age though. I see. That would be nightmare, right? <laughs> Taking to the different school. Maybe that's that's. Then after they took six kids to the different schools, they now going to pick up, right? <laughs> yeah, I see. Yeah, I was just looking at education, um, like a data before, you know, doing this scope because I teach online, I, you know, teach senior to online and I, you know, that volunteer at the library and internet education is getting bigger and growing. I was thinking about, you know, the adult school would be okay for the online, but I was thinking about can we adapt this type of system to the kids? Kids can learn from online, but it could be yes, but physically, I'm not sure. Because kids are a little different story. Probably that's why you're interested in kids development and you can, you know, supporting each other and communicating each other or maybe, I don't know, I'm very, I'm very curious and interested in the system, but I'm, you know, I'm from countryside and I know the, the some of the people, you know, even my friends is living very far away 
and she took four hours to get my school. Then I was really surprised that for how she coming to the school and going back to home every day because she lives far away and she couldn't there's no school around there but very interesting things to think about but there's always have a, been a solution but I can't think deeply enough to thinking about the solution yet but oh I see yeah that's that kind of things happen too yeah probably my friend's area there's a mountainside and it takes four hours to get my school may not have internet even now I think right hmm that's interesting the beach okay beach no it has no internet <laughs> But, you know, before the internet, we used to have like a DVD, right? DVD or cassette tape to send out to someone to learn like language or something. So maybe if we go back to the old school way and we can find a way. Obvious. <laughs> Interesting, because you have to record first then you know put on OBS to broadcast yeah I was wondered I, I was you know I did watching your scope I thought you were doing live then when I click on it I s realized that was OBS That's interesting because we rely on the Wi-Fi all the time. So now we kind of forgot about the old school way, like forgot about DVD, forgot about cassette tape, forgot about book, paper book. That's right. You know, if we think really deeply and if we use our brain properly, <laughs> so we get the better solution or a good idea and creative idea. Definitely, you have a you know really great idea. VHS, that's right. I throw them out. I throw all the you know. I decided. I was thinking about you know converting to the digital. Your name is production. That's right. Yes, that's right. Because now this technology has been changing so quickly. Now is everything is cloud and we don't need to buy a computer every year. <laughs> yeah, you can go on live whenever you can and you don't have to carry camcorder anymore. I can make story video using only a smartphone. I can edit on my smartphone. That's life has been changed so much. You can upload the video from YouTube from your smartphone to YouTube without accessing your laptop or computer. If OBS has a app, I don't have to do this on my computer anymore. <laughs> I found out the new iPhone OS has a screen capture. So now I don't have to do some screen capture on my desktop. That's right.
So this is the New York City map I'm sharing. You know, if someone watching the play, maybe I can explain a little bit. Yeah, that's right. But this is just like an example to show in the New York City because you don't have to target only New York City because that that's too small, I think. Even though New York City has a lot of population, but it depends on your business and you can target only New York, New York City. Yeah, the place power button and the circle together. Um, you talking about the screen capturing? I think I, I used it different way. Is that is that one? Is that iOS eleven point three? Okay. Mm, okay, now it's changed. It's interestingly changed. Like, uh, how you can do that? Um, when you open at the bottom, then you can hold on to the um, four icon. I forgot, like a like a four icon. I forgot what it is. Then it's gonna pop up the screen casting. And now 11.3 is the iPad version is looks like Mac on desktop. So I Apple TV mirroring is different now. <laughs> yeah, OBS is so many things to you know manipulate it, not uh, implement. If you're getting into it, you can cre be creative lots of different things like you can do three different camera to switching around right it's like a tv studio okay this is a japanese tip mini japanese lesson <laughs> Avatar, they don't have a Japanese word, they just say avatar. <laughs> That's the Japanese pronunciation. Avatar. Because of the movie called Avatar, and it makes people confused. NHK? NHK world, you mean? Right? NHK is very solid program, I would say. Um, but sometimes it's too classic to me. But it would be great for the people who wanted to learn Japanese culture. It's very like a classical way to show in Japan. It's like a what do you call that? UK TV station? BBC? <laughs> Why not? Oops, sorry, that's another timer it goes off. Everything is so like a mechanical and I feel like I lived in the technology world. Yeah, that's right. So the second word, word is target. It's also mato. Japanese word mato shiboru. But they used the English word target all the time. Then they started to say target do shiboru. So that means they're using the same word twice. Game show? Yeah, because Japanese is getting fam famous for anime, either anime or a game, like a PlayStation or a Nintendo.
and also uh, Meido, Meido Cafe. <laughs> All type of kind of geeky things. No, <laughs> not that kind. Okay. So as you know, I have two different channels, one for Japanese and one for English. The channel you're watching is English channel right now. Yeah. Because Japan is a small country, if someone is becoming famous, it's gonna stay longer to be famous. But in States, if you become famous, you have to do a lot of like promotion and you know making a lot of effort to be stay top of the celebrity or being famous it's harder to be being famous for a long time <laughs> yeah. I think business wise it's same thing so if if you do exactly the same thing in Japan and United States, maybe Japan would be easier to be on top. Yeah. Sometimes the company owner who become a top of the some industry in Japan, they think that they can be number one in United States. They came to the same methodology to come to United States to do this business, but it, it's not gonna go well because they didn't have a business canvas. They didn't know, even those type of people, they don't know who is the target customer. They never do the marketing research I won't say many company, but uh, some I you know I see some of the people. Yeah, we are all producer, creator, <laughs> opinionator. Okay, the today's quote. I picked this one. What do you think? Yeah, some do is pretty, but that's a that's the thing because if you do really well in your country or your town you think that you can do out same thing outside but sometimes you need to do the research and you need to do kind of a scale the different way don't do exactly same even though in the united states if you're doing well this month may not doing next month even though you're doing exactly the same, right? Like for instance, <laughs> that's right. For instance, like Amazon Go is very hot this week because they just opened up the store two days ago. If you scoping Amazon Go store, so everybody's watching. But if you do the scope next week, may not everybody, you know, get the attention. Yeah, that's right. So that's why we need to be creative. We have to always, you know, um, watching lots of different things and think about what is hot, what is trend in the next week or next month, like a trend watcher. <laughs> I really admire all the people doing scoping regularly because they need to have a gut <laughs> and uh, passionate passion enthusiasm too
So if you're a business owner, that's right. We need to have a guts. All the business owner not selling products or services, we need to sell the problem you solve. Great, you have a great friend. That's a good thing. Because if you're doing good and you're going to have a great friend. If you're doing bad, you're going to have a bad friend. <laughs> Sorry, my dog is the another timer. <laughs> oh, that's nice. Because you're doing really good. Everybody like respect you and trust you and care about you. Right, building community is a way to, you know, building the business as well and also, you know, having good community is the having good life. <laughs> Even virtually, that's fine, right? Yes. Thank you so much for stopping by. I think two timer is goes off. I think I have to do something in my kitchen. <laughs> my dog is barking now. <laughs> Hope you everyone had a great evening or a great good day. We have to cook and eat. <laughs> Thank you so much. Ja mata ne. Yeah, I think so. Panasonic founder say in the he is a turtle. Right, steady it'd be the ideal. Yeah, that's nice. Lots of shooting star. Thank you very much. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> oh, my phone got really dying. Yes, okay. But you're shining. That's a good thing. My phone got died. Thank you very much. See you tomorrow.